Does your family land on your naughty or nice list? For most of us, it's probably both. If you're dreading decking the halls with your relatives this year, Local 3's Connie Fellman has some seasonal survival tips that may help you survive the holidays. If you feel holidays are more of a hassle than a Hallmark movie, you're not alone. According to a recent poll, at least 75% of Americans admit they need to escape family this time of year. But there are ways to make the most of the season. Here's a holiday survival guide. No, no, we're all in this together. This is a full-blown four-alarm holiday emergency here. Do you associate the holidays with good memories or troubling times? My stepdad's kind of annoying. The best part is spending time with my mom, and the worst part is having my mom tell me what to do. And the worst part is probably we don't like to do it, but we talk politics. On average, Americans will stay with family for three and a half days. Nearly 40% say finding sleeping arrangements is one of the most stressful parts of preparing for out-of-town family. Other top concerns, lack of privacy, family getting on your nerves, and drama between family members. Most of us want harmony in our families. Yes. One of the most important sanity savers, plan early. Who's traveling? What are the sleeping arrangements? Set realistic expectations. When you adjust your mindset to something that's realistic, you're already ahead of the game. Keep healthy boundaries. It's important to find a balance between being generous and hospitable. Most importantly, keep the lines of communication open with your significant other about how you're feeling. If you're feeling that you're not accepted, I would say the first thing to talk to your mate about that. Taking the time to make a survival strategy will help your sanity, peace, and joy this holiday season. One last tip. Try outsourcing some of your big holiday meals. Experts say order in all of the holiday sides and trimmings and just focus on the turkey or ham. That way you spend less time in the kitchen and more time enjoying the season. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 3 News.